Football is back, and you might say already, but for a handful of area high schools in the WIAA, they opted to pass on the fall and take a fling at the spring. Can't wait to feel the butterflies in your stomach, and then, you know, as you're counting down, the ball goes up. It's just unbelievable feeling. At Nathan Hale High School in West Allis, they have a good problem. The Huskies had about 90 kids go out for football and not enough equipment. Um, that's definitely a good problem. Obviously, I had to have conversations about, hey, we got to get more equipment uh, and make sure that, you know, player safety is number one. We have some kids trying out that haven't played, you know, that have played other sports like soccer or uh, trying. They, they decided to come out and try it. A lost fall is providing energy and excitement this spring. Probably the best feeling I've had in a real long time, especially with COVID going on these past few months. And uh, I mean, we've been, our whole team's been working for the past 16 months, waiting to give a chance to come back out here. It starts with the numbers. Um, and then from there, um, you know, you guys coming out, checking us out. And I told the kids and I told the parents day one, this is a leadership development course. We just happen to play football and that's a sport we love to play. Yes, for athletes like Toby Sag, it's hard to balance football and their normal spring sports like track. I'll miss the indoor season for track, but I'll for sure be going out there for the, for the later outdoor season. But when the ball kicks off Friday night, these kids will be having a ball. I'm excited that our seniors get the opportunity to play right now. Um, you know, they missed out in the fall where, you know, 70% of the schools went about. Um, and now they're having that opportunity to finish out their high school career playing football. New team, new conference, new year. So it'll be really exciting to see what happens. Nathan Hale visits Whitnell on Friday night, and we'll have coverage of that and more. The Friday football frenzy is back, baby. Lance Allen, TMJ4 Sports.